Hi everyone, Emma here. I have an unboxing to do. This is Leather Findings. So they're stainless steel items to put on your leather to make your awesome leather bracelets. So the first two are from, let me see if I have the seller's name. This is on AliExpress and the seller's name or the store name. Oh, I'm using this, um, I'm using my computer and I always do this on my tablet and it's set up differently. So I don't see the seller's name at all on this. What the heck? Oh, it's called <laughs> Leather Craft Store. <laughs> Yay, I'm going to have to check this out. So, um, yeah, so these are uh, screw rivet, rivets, and it's you get 10 of them, and they're the shape of a heart. So there's the silver. Let me open that up. There's the silver. That's what it looks like on the back. These are metal and they're, I think they said that they, the, the coating is plated. And then there's a, so it comes with the screws. So there's 10 hearts and 10 screws. They're super easy to use and super easy because you can, now here's the silver one on some old um, white leather that's kind of hacked up. I think it might not even be real leather. But it was an old belt. So um, this is of course the, the spot where they put the uh, where you attach your belt. So I've actually created a whole bunch of strips and made bracelets with these. But So here's the thing with this. They're a bit long. So you would have to put something in there like a little um, you know, a piece of felt or another piece of leather in there to get it to stay and hopefully to get it flush too. So this one sticks out a bit, but on this one, I fixed it. I put a bigger hole so that it sits flush and this is the gold one. So I just put a piece of leather underneath. Now it sticks out a bit, but yeah, I haven't, I haven't worked through that one yet. I was like, oh, really? I love these. So that's those there. I wanted to mention I did um, an unboxing of a set of these stamps from uh, AliExpress. And there's a whole bunch of these little interesting designs. And they come with this tool here. So the handle, it's got like a, a ball bearing in there. And you just pop these on they're pretty easy to use now initially I said it was kind of junky I wasn't sure if they'd be any good so I tested it on a piece of leather and I am shocked I am just totally blown away that this is what I got from this tool I'm stunned so you just treat your leather the way you do for stamping all you have to do is wet your leather and then put your Thing there and do a little bit of a, a tap with your mallet and that's what you get. I think if you were looking for something deeper and of course I didn't put any um, dye or anything to create the darkness so just stamping it on this leather get, gave it that kind of finished look. So yeah I'm super excited. I'm going to be making a bunch of earrings with scrap leather and We'll do some tutorials on that. So let's get to the, the stainless steel stuff. Oh my gosh, this stuff is amazing. So this is all from one seller. The store's name is M Blast. Um, I'll, I'll try and add it to the description. So these, I've made bracelets with these. So I reordered them. And these are just gorgeous. Like, I'm blown away buy this stuff and the prices are really reasonable as well so 
So there's that one. So some of these come like two for six dollars or you know four for six dollars. The other thing I got were these um, spacer beads and they are great. Let me see if I have an example of one of these. I'm trying to put together some uh, bracelets to give you an idea. So you put the this is I think five millimeter um, leather cord so you'd put that there and one of the items that's coming up but you'll get a sneak preview look at these are like stainless steel they're incredible so they have the holes there now there's space there they like they should fit like with friction um, you can put your glue I might put something more than just glue in there like maybe a little bit more um i don't know maybe a bit of leather around the edge just so that it it fits snug but anyway this is let's get this in so i can show you like that and then Oh, I had this set for another one. Never, never mind. Here's another one. The heart with the wing. The same idea. So this is... So it would fit like this. Yeah, I had it this way for a reason. Because I feel like the wing should go down. There. So it would go like this. This is um, hard to do when it's not glued in. And I keep forgetting it's not glued in. I'm like, okay, it's there. So this is what your bracelet would look like. Anyway, there's, and then you could put another spacer bead on the end here too. To hold those two pieces together. So let me put that back. In its little tray so that's these guys here I got I think I got like a set of each so that um, I would have like a variety of sizes that I could use so there's a smaller one they do have really good measurements so you could so the one is like this one here is a little more oval and this one's a little kind of the ends come a bit down a bit so it makes a difference if you use these you know what I'm talking about there's another one really nice and then this one's a little flatter more square looking and again rounded I think these are gonna be let me see I have some I'm trying to get some that fit my leather for these anchor bracelets and I got these and I can't find where I got them because they fit perfectly to wrap it around and sit it to the point they fit so well that you don't have to add glue to your bracelet so let me show you here so I have it on both sides but if you see these are not stainless steel and you can kind of see like already it's it's not shiny anymore so this part is rubbing off whatever coating well it's really bad on this side so I need to find the right size bead though it's not gonna do it that one's too small this one might this one's a bit wider so I might have to break down and add glue or squeeze it a bit I don't know how stainless steel is for molding like that so there and then there's some big ones awesome oh these are <laughs> I should cut these open so you can see them 
Oh, wow. Oh, it's too bad. It's just on one side. I wonder if this will come off. So here's the thing. I talk about this a lot when I do AliExpress purchases. Check your stuff. Check, check, check. This is if you were selling bracelets or even if you're making it for your husband or your son or, you know, like this is no good. I might try and take some mineral spirits to see if I can get that ink off. But I don't know if you can see that. So. But check. But these are beautiful. Oh. Let me see how this fits in this. I, I have some thicker leather too. So. Yeah. That is really nice. Wow. So yeah. Um, with class for bracelets. Um, sometimes you can't get the like a say a lobster claw you can't get it to open and you don't notice you buy your stuff comes like a, a package of 10 you put it in your container you go to make a bracelet you pull it out like two months later and it's and then you realize well let me check the others and all of them are like that i had that happen to me <laughs> oh my god I'm seeing anchors. This is my, like my all-time favorite one of these buttons. So they all come packaged like this individually. So they're not like bouncing and scratching on each other. Oh my God. Oh, these are unbelievable. Unbelievable. Wow. That's amazing. Okay. This. So I never even thought to order these because I was kind of sticking with the... Um, let me open this one too. Well, this is a different one, I think. They're bigger. Yeah, these are... Yeah, so this side's flat and this one has a design on it. So they are bigger. Look at that. Yeah, so I've been buying these, like, you know, one set here, one set there. And then I started realizing the bracelets come out like this. This is what started it, this anchor. And I started doing these leather bracelets. They're so easy to do. They're keepsakes when people get them as gifts, like, you know, and you're using really good material. So there's the ship's mast. Let me see if I can, oh, there's the little ones. So this guy has, um, like Thor stuff and all kinds of just stunning what do you see this is like this is like the you know the stuff that I already bought these styles and then the spacers the next bag is just incredible so I, I have to say this one I never thought to buy it and then I saw it and I was like this is like incredible how gorgeous this is because to me this would make it would still make an amazing men's bracelet. Look, the back is all done. The sides. This is unbelievable. So, the here's the thing. These, if you were doing the, the round, um, your bracelet would have, like, it would sit this way. I would kind of like it to sit this way too. <laughs> and you know what? These uh, openings would not stop me from figuring out a way to put this on a bracelet this way. <laughs> I'm like, I'm so like my dad. He was always trying to figure things out and doing things with what he had. And I do that a lot too. But oh my God, these are gorgeous. I cannot believe it. They're so soft polished beautifully and 
really well finished. And the, the little bit of etching or dyeing inside and the relief, just beautiful. And there's these. So these ones I never bought. These are like the, um, uh, I forget what they're called for positioning. And these are gorgeous. I'm hoping at one point to just make a whole bunch of these and do like a pop-up sale at the uh, farmer's market. I think I would sell them all for sure. People would go nuts. Because they're not that expensive. Like even, even if you paid $5 for this and it's not, it's like, let me see if I have one of the other ones up here um, I'm gonna go to I'm just gonna bring up my order and give you an idea of the price range I think I I had tried to figure it out before I came to do the video but it's just all over the place here um so something like this would be four of these for seven dollars they charge shipping but i have to tell you so this person they offer free shipping after 28 dollars and change um, but what you have to do when you go to order the item It'll say shipping a dollar or something. I'm just, oh, this one doesn't have it, but so it'll show shipping a dollar seventy five or something like that. But it has another option for shipping. So go down and click on the other option and hit apply so that it'll apply. It'll be some weird number like sixty four dollars or something. Just ignore that. Then when you go to your cart, it will take all the charges off but if you don't do that it will still show like the dollar 75 for each item kind of thing so just a hint if you're not sure just ask in the comments or email me and i'll explain it and if you want i'll do a video on it because a lot of sellers will give you free shipping some of them it's only like ten dollars so definitely but you have to know how to adjust it in your cart. So just let you know. So that, these are just amazing. Oh. And there's some more. Yeah, I, I, the ink, these ones here are incredible, these anchor ones. Unbelievable. <laughs> okay, let's let's get the other stuff. I think I gotta make room now that I flipped them over. They're all gonna get mixed up. Oh, they're so lovely. Okay, next one is this one here. This was a set of two, and I won't take this one out of the package. It's a magnetic clasp. This is what it looks like. So it came with two and said it looks like it's not shiny. I should look at that because yeah, it's, it was just the packaging made it look. So these, <laughs> these, okay, so these are so well made. I have to tell you, I couldn't get it undone. The magnet is so strong. So I was sitting there going, what am I doing wrong? <laughs> so just bend it that way they also have the kind of security little bump there that holds it and then one on the other side and watch how strong these are like that's incredible so these holes i think are five millimeter because these this is my bolo leather and it just fits 
So that would be a lovely bracelet with the bolo leather. Let me get the other side so you can see. that. Lovely. Simple. You can put something on the other side. The other thing I was going to mention too for the um, these here, if you have leather that's say this size, which I think is five millimeter. Well, let me see. No, this is six actually, this one here. So, but it's still not big enough to get this to fit with friction what you can do is they have little rubber I call them gaskets I think they call them rings and I've ordered some some are clear some are kind of a, a reddish brown and then the others are black I think I ordered black and clear I wasn't too sure about the reddish brown it looked too red to me but yeah, you, they're little silicone gaskets that you put in there and you can put it on both sides and it holds this in place and you can't see it. It slides right into your, your hole. So that's, that's lovely. Let's look at the, all of them like that. This is when I have like playtime. Oh my gosh. <gasps> this is my next bracelet. Oh my gosh, that's incredible. I'm going to order some more of those. They're incredible. They're so gorgeous. I am gifts at Christmas for my nieces. They would love that. Very beautiful. So there's those. And then, oh, oh. These are class as well. Wow. These I haven't taken out of the package. Let me enlarge this so you can really see. <gasps> Look at the background. It's like textured little bumps. Check them both. This is beautiful. And oh yeah. So the same. It's got those little security very nice so there's the holes massive holes you can do multiple round but I'm gonna be doing some thick leather like I will stack and glue leather together and then finish it into a nice let's see if this side's Oh, yeah. So something like that. Really nice. Wow. I um placed another order. I didn't open these and look at them and I placed another order and I'm like kicking myself now. Because some of these things like this, I never really would have thought to buy one of these. And now I'm like, oh my gosh, I so have to buy some more of those. Look at this. Motorcycle. For your motorcycle uh, family members. I used to drive a motorcycle, so I'm, uh, I'll probably be making one of these for myself. So these ones here, like this, are closures. So you're going to need a loop like this. To go around your, let me pull this out a bit, around your uh, clasp, that, and the holes. Let's see if these ones fit. So, something like that. I got the um, the leather at Exotica Leather. So if you're interested, let me know and I'll give you the link. Ta -da. That is awesome. Oh, 
That's the, um, huh, I don't know what that is. Maybe some finish or something. Ink from the, the relief stuff. So. Oh, there's the other motorcycle one. Yeah, there's some dirt in it. That one too. Let's keep that one there. This one's hilarious. It's pirate time. These are unbelievable. Look at that. I'm stunned at the detail. So the sword, the feather, another sword going through his skull, and the 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 end of the sword is all filigree on both sides. The eye patch. The skull and crossbones on his hat. That is amazing. And this is another one of those where it's a closure. These are incredible. And they were so, like, I was trying to get an idea for the price of certain things to say, you know, if you use this and maybe um, a foot of leather, like by the time you're done, it would be about $10 and I'll do some videos where I make a bracelet and I'll tell you exactly how much it costs to make that bracelet. Cause then if you think of it, if you're going to go to, um, craft sales and stuff like that, and you can make these so quickly and easily, you can actually make them in front of the people because if you want to make them so that they're specific to their size wrist, and you have the correct size leather that fits in here. You're just adding a dab of glue. You're cutting it to their size and gluing it. Put your slider bead. You're done. And you, you can easily sell these for $30 or more. There's, there, you know. I don't know how else to say it. It's just uh, blows my mind. <laughs> So well, let's take a look at these. These two were the wings and we'll pull them out of the container. These are crazy. I cannot believe how beautiful they are. And you could use these for like a, um, I'm trying to think what they call those necklaces that have a dangly bit like a lanyard or something you could actually do a bracelet or a necklace like that so this is your pendant at the bottom of the but definitely this is a awesome closure so well done and then the heart it, or not the heart the um the other wing with the rose with look at the the leaves are just incredible. I'm stunned how gorgeous these are. Let's go to these. I won't open this one. Here's, I'll show you. I've got one already out to show you. Look at how amazing that is. Now, this is some thick leather that you're going to need for this. So this would be one I would recommend you like build your leather up so maybe two layers of a really thick leather um, let's see. I think I put some leather out just to give you an idea what it would look like on the leather so I think of that so this leather is pretty good thickness you would probably need three layers of this, but you just basically glue it together and slide this on. Gorgeous. I'm stunned at how amazing these are. How pretty they are. I also took out some like 
mahogany stained leather. Look at that. Just gorgeous. So that's the gold one. Um, did they take the others out? So they had silver in black. Let's look at the black. Wow, these are amazing. Oh, that is awesome. Yeah, let's look at it in the... Let me use my camera here. Wow. Again, really well done. Let's look at it on the leather. Yeah, I think you'd need a different... Because it's so dark, you'd need it. Oh, it's actually not too bad. You see it coming out of the hole there. That is pretty... But as you know, I I just bought a whole bunch of leather and I've got some pretty crazy colored leather. So those are beautiful. Let's take a look at the silver ones. I bought, I thought I bought two. You know what? Maybe they only had one set of gold. Because I thought I bought two gold and two silver. Oh my god, the silver is amazing. Look at that. That is awesome. These look... Well, I guess they're pretty thin. So, I should mention, when you buy stuff that has that's black, be careful. It's painted on. And I'm just showing you. There's a little, what looks like a chip. But you know what? It's smooth. Like, I can't feel. So I wonder if that's something else. But I have bought some items from AliExpress. Um, I don't expect this seller would have any junky stuff because I've looked at the stuff he has. It's amazing. So, yeah. There's that. And then we have a lion that is amazing that's incredible and this is another slider so that's what they call these sliders they go on your leather this one's heavy wow but some people like wearing chunky heavy bracelets I'm just looking to see what that is back there that's just amazing I can't stop touching it we ain't done yet oh my god this is incredible so it has holes on the like jawbone this is really cool these are amazing So there was two of those and two lions. And these I had four of. You know, I could just go down to the corner where we have Fisherman's Cove and walk around and show people and they would just buy this stuff. Just like this, without the bracelet. They'd be like, yep, give me one of the, give me two of those, give me. <laughs> they are incredible. So we have the blue nose here. This is a, um, a schooner. Looks like. Wow. 
we often have the um I'm trying to think what they call it the ship's festival or something and it's all like the schooners from all over the world come here it's unbelievable these are the last two so I'm still doing beaded bracelet uh, videos and designs in case you're wondering but uh, this is kind of my side thing for um, you know making gifts for people and for you know like I said I want to do a pop-up sale this way there's no commitment it's just like show up with what you have and then go home and don't worry about it kind of thing so this is gorgeous these are amazing so which one is your favorite let me know these are crazy <laughs> um, these are this one's hard not to be my favorite <laughs> Yeah, pretty stunning. Thanks for joining me, and we'll see you in the next video. If you have any questions, please uh, comment and um, yeah, let me know what your question is. I will do my best to answer it. Take care, everybody. Bye.